Hey, I'm Ryan. Hi, I'm Becky. And we're going to show you a last minute shopping guide to the Fremont Sunday Market where you can pick up all your gifts for all your family members and friends at the Fremont Sunday Market. Let's go see what we can find. Sounds like a good deal. Wish us luck. So, this is Lachlan. Uh, he's one of our antique uh, dealers and he's going to show me what I can buy for about between $50 and $100 for my dad and my grandfather okay. uh, at the Fremont Sunday Market. We have great deals galore. All right, so tell me a little bit about uh, what you got here. Well, we have a lot of furniture, okay. a lot of collectibles. Pretty much what we're doing is furniture and vintage collectibles. So how much is this stuff? This is about, this is $80 is what I'm asking, okay. and this this particular bird cage is Victorian, and if this was in a shop, you'd be paying about $250. About $250? About $250. Okay, that's pretty good to know. $80 okay, down nice. here. Okay. And uh, so I'm looking for something of my grandfather. Um, rocking chair? What's that cost here? These two rocking chairs are actually $30 a piece. Nice. Good deal. So if you're at the pottery barn, you probably end up paying like $150. Oh, yeah. Maybe. And they wouldn't have as much character. Absolutely. And your grandma knows if you, if you want breakfast in bed, you get one of these, and it's, uh, it's already antique for you. It's so that's, that's uh, seventy dollars. But what's behind this? That is actually about a hundred years old. A hundred years old. So for seventy tray. bucks, that's pretty good. Um, and I can't imagine grandma or mom not liking this. So, all right, good to know. Uh, the globes. Globes are $25 a piece. $25 bucks a piece. And if you want an exercise equipment, you got one of these. This is one of the first ever rowing this machines. Is, this is no an, way. It is an antique 1920s rowing machine. My dad would like this. There's a little nostalgic history behind that. Lots of funky stuff down here. So the idea is that these are things that you, it changes every week. These are things you only be able to find at the Fremont Sunday Market. If you were to go to an antique dealer or a store, You'd probably be paying twice as much, at least. So, Lachlan's on the East End. Uh, thanks very much. More about these. These are what? Railroad? These are railroad lanterns, and these are actually fairly rare. Uh, these have a cobalt lens, which you just don't see. These are extremely hard to find. And these two back here are actually antique railroad signals. So Grandpa might like that because he might have actually known about the railroad in my, my generation. <laughs> These are $75 a piece. If you were to go to another place, you'd probably end up paying anywhere about $250. Yes. And uh, for the lady in your life who likes purple, perfect. It's beautiful. Cobalt lens, she'll like that. It's fancy. I don't know anything about that, but uh, there you go. And then $45 for the, the kid who doesn't like the seat on the uh, tricycle. True. <laughs> cool.